Hello friends, this is Ramana. Today I will show demo on one important SPL entry question. That is how to add new column to the existing table and how to drop the column from the existing table. First I will show my table name. It's the EMP. It contains five columns and nine rows. Uh, ID, name, title, manager ID and join date are the columns. Now in this column I want to add one more, in this table I want to add one more column that is gender. There is no gender column here. Now I, am, I want to add the gender column to employee table. So how can I add? First you give the command order table and mention EMP table name. In next line you have to add keyword, add Mention your column name. I am mentioning the gender and mention your data type. Ten. So, uh, if you execute this and check your table, so new column gender will appear with all null values. So, this is how you need to add the new column to the existing table. Just add your keyword and the uh, new column name and its data type that's all for adding the any column any new column to the existing table now uh, what I am doing now for dropping the column uh, I want to drop the same G, uh, gender column again so how can I write the query alter, alter table e EMP drop so here you need to mention column, drop column, gender and execute and run your query. So see here there is no gender column here. Just I have to explain the, the difference between the, these two. <coughs> In alter if you, if you want to add the new column just you have to mention the alter table. Alter table is common for both these for adding new column or for, for dropping the column. Uh, first line of syntax is common alter table table. So if you want to add, you just mention the add keyword and uh, uh, column name with the data type. If you want to drop, mention drop keyword and here instead of, instead of directly mention the column and gender column name you have to mention the drop syntax mention the column and the gender as well and the gender means the column name so this is how you need to write the you need to answer the question if you know how to write the syntax for adding the column to the existing table and dropping the column from the existing table Thanks for watching the video. Thank you very much.